All right, guys, we are back. It's a new week, and it's Monday, the 26th of August. We have six days left in the month. We had about 20, we almost had $3,000 made for the month, and I want to get to $4,000, so that means this week, I want to grind and get to $1,000. We did not make $1,000 last week. Fell short by about $275 or so, and I want to change that for this week. You know, I want to grind a little bit more than we did last. We really didn't grind last week. We didn't. So it is, it is all good. Um, I'm at the Home Depot right now in Valley Stream, waiting for the 620 drops. And hopefully I get something because I got to be home to drop the wife to work for eight. So it's not like I have all morning. So most likely I'll only be able to do one order according to where it's going. If it's going close, Maybe I have to swing back and bang out a spark really quick or Uber Eats or something. But right now, only one order. You know, I don't know if I'll do anything throughout the rest of the day, but if I do, I'll show to let you know. So the plan is, there's some, well, there will be drops. Today's Monday. Orders from Sunday would be here today. I, I know I'm going to get something. I'm going to get orders. So I'll, I'll, I'll let you know. If you see me walking into the store, I got something. And I'll let you know. All right, guys, so we got something, a huge gig, 51 and some change going into Queens Village. That's close to where I live, and it's a perfect order to, you know, probably see if I get something else at another Home Depot. So let me do this one quick and get out of here. We're picking up some trash cans, recycle bins, and, you know, all that good stuff. So let's get it, man. Yeah, baby. All right, guys, we all loaded up. Sorry, I didn't actually record myself loading those things up. One of the employees and I were talking, you know. I have friends out here, man, so. <laughs> we were just chatting about, um, you know, just life things, you know. So, I have eight bags of mulch, and I have four trash bins, including, um, recycle bin and while I was in the store I actually had put in for another gig that was here paying $24 going in that direction that's the mulch and I got it I was like wow so all together we're making about $75 plus two trips and I'm gonna get those wrapped up really fast and then be home extra early to drop my wife to work I did put in for some of the 635 drops but I didn't get them. And I know if I had time, like if I had time, like I don't have time, but if I had time, let me see something. Let me see something. Hmm. I was thinking I could put in for these things and when I drop my wife to work, I could just deliver them. Maybe I could do that. Let me see. 16 bucks. Let me put in for this gig as well. Let me just put in for this gig. It's coming back over to this side. It's from the Elmont Home Depot, so yeah, let me put in for that. <laughs> let me put in for that. Let me check the Lindbrook. Yeah, that one's closer. Yeah, let me put in for that one. I might just get it, cause I have a lot of time. Should be um at the first drop off. Let me see something, complete pickup. Should be at the first drop off in about five minutes. And then the second one in about maybe 15. Should be done with this like about seven or eight or so. That'll give me some time to run to the Home Depot. If I'm lucky, pick up those orders, go home, switch vehicles, drop my wife and then drop off those items. Yeah, that's the plan. Hopefully I get lucky so we could make around 90 something dollars this morning. Seven minutes to the drop, guys. Eight bags of mulch. Let's make it happen.
guys got those mulch you know um damn telling me to retake the photo god damn annoying I pressed something, that's why. But got that dropped off and 655. I don't think I the order is still pending, the other one. I don't know why they don't just give it to me. Because nobody wanna take these little routes paying, you know, $16 to go nine miles. People don't wanna take those when they, they have other orders. And it's not worth it for other people who didn't have any orders for the for the job. So but I like those little route orders though. You pay them up, $16, you add, you know, two more, that's almost $50, you drop off six things, six little things, locally. So, I don't mind. So maybe I'll get it, maybe I won't, but um, the next drop off is uh, 14 minutes away, perfect. As a matter of fact, you know what? What? Oh shit, I should have turned right there. I'm gonna actually cancel the bid for that gig that I put in for. Yeah, I'm gonna cancel it. Don't wanna be rushing. Don't wanna be rushing, man. You know what? I'm gonna leave it. Whatever. I'm gonna leave it. Stick to the plan. All right, guys, here for the drop off. Let's get it done before the garbage truck comes down here. Alright guys, got that done. Let's see from the picture. And let's get out of here. 716. Well it's actually 715. Um I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna head home. Not far from home. Well seven minutes away from home. So I'm gonna just go home. Get home early. Get the wife to work on time and see what the day has in store for me so since my laptop got you know corrupted basically i now have to go um downstairs in the basement and transfer some files onto that computer and because i have another macbook down there and start editing the video for last saturday so i'm behind but not crazy behind because the videos that i made during the week they aren't long you see, so I'm just going to come by Monday to Friday. I have Saturday, Sunday, Monday to Friday, Saturday, and so I have about four videos. I'm about four videos behind, so I'm going to try to catch up. I'm going to just try to catch up, you know. I don't want to go too far behind and just get them out. The videos, you know, for accountability, show you guys, you know, how I make my money. Also to help you guys, and in the process, I'm also helping myself motivating myself you know just watching you know and tracking the way you know I do my thing so um, we did good man we did good today oh shoot I haven't even finished close out the damn order and I'm here talking to you so yeah, let me do that um, so yeah man um, finished doing that and we at 75.98. What a morning! God damn! <laughs> so, I am definitely gonna go back out later, but not for long. Not for long. I don't wanna go stupid. You see what I mean? 
But I can't wait until uh, my son goes back to school. I have a little time before I go back to work. I, act I actually have 13 days after my son starts school before I go back to work. So I'm gonna really try to capitalize on those days, man. And I mean, I'm gonna try to make at least three grand in that 13 days. So wish me luck. Guys, if you don't see me now, see me late. If you, if you don't see me now, if you don't see me later, I'll see you tomorrow. All right, guys, I need to burn a little bit of time. So, um, actually, before I go to Burlington to look for something, so I got a CVS gig paying $9.99. It's not going too far. Let's make some more money, baby. All right. Dropping this off. All right, guys, completed our order. If I do have anything else, I'll let you know. But we're making that money. So, guys, I was actually home, chilling. Just opened the roadie map. Saw a huge gig from the Valley Stream Home Depot. I said, you know what? Let me just put in for it. Put in for it. Got the notification. Accepted. Nothing feels good like a roadie acceptance message. When you see that, accept your, oh man, your bid has been accepted. That, man, if you know, you know. If you know, you know, you know what I'm saying? If you know, you know indeed. But I'm heading there. It looks like it's like a fridge. It could either be a fridge or a water heater. It's going out to Uniondale. My um, son is with his uncle in the backyard playing with the water. So, um, yeah, he's preoccupied because I couldn't bring him with me. For the CVS gigs, yeah, but not for these big ones. Not for these big ones. And this is, the, this is when I wish the... There's moments I wish the van had seats in it. You see what I mean? Like, I could just fold down a couple and have him there and, you know? Yeah, but it is what it is, man, you know? Gotta accept it for what it is. But let's hope the process is smooth and the, the order is ready. Cause I don't wanna be here waiting half an hour, you know, 45 minutes for anything right about now. I want the order to be ready to move because I wanna be back home in a jiffy. So guys, see your Home Depot. And what this means, this also means, if everything goes well and we could complete this gig, it means that I won't have to go out later. You see, if I could avoid going out later, that's great so let's do it let's get it done so guys oh man you know what happened you know what happened went in there waited a little bit i got help from my friend in the store there and when she checked the order the person ordered one of those retro fridges refrigerators i should say like a red retro refrigerator probably to put in his garage or something and she, immediately she say, yeah, we don't have these. These are online only. Check the computer, check online. Yeah, nothing in the store. And the order was canceled. So from $50, I ended up getting eight bucks. Why this guy don't wanna cross? I got eight bucks. We already need to do something better. They need to do something better when it comes to that, man. Because I left my house. I came all the way over here. You see what I mean? Say I'm gonna make a quick 52 bucks and go back home only to make $8. Eight, come on, man. And I know a lot of people have a problem with that. I know that, $8. Another thing I did, um. I did turn on Spark and I got an order from Home Depot. It was paying $22 for three drop-offs. Uh, small items, I think. And I had to cancel that too because I was just about to make about $74 plus any wait time. Let's say about $75 and only made $10.98. It is what it is, man. $10.98. So, so far today, we let me just scratch that out because I had already wrote it down. I had a feeling it was gonna get canceled, you know. I had a feeling. So um yeah, we're still doing good though. Still doing really good, about 80, 
85, 97, and 8. It's about 93, 97. And let's say 3. We had about um, we had about $96 for the day. Close. $96 or so. It is what it is, man. So, I don't know if I'm going to go out later, but we shall see. We shall see. Not really feeling it. But guys, I'll keep you posted, though.